Monkey 5950 coming at you here. This is today, April the 6th, 2017 on a Thursday. I'm going to get to the topic here in a minute the, that you've seen, uh, the title. We're going to get to that in just a second. But today i got to talk a little bit about the weather. I just mowed the other day, and we're getting pumped from Mother Nature. This is an April Fool's joke, right? <coughs> Excuse me. It's April 6th. I just mowed the other day, and man, the temperature started in the 50s today, and it's going to go down into the 43, like 6 o'clock tonight. And tomorrow, high in the 30s, and we're supposed to get one to three inches of snow. That's crazy. And speaking of April, has that giraffe had that daggone baby yet? I'm going to do a video on April. April, if you're watching this, you better pop that baby out, son. Millions of people watching their giraffe walk around pregnant. That giraffe probably be like, I'm miserable. And they got me on camera feeding me carrots and sticking my tongue out, making me beg for the carrot on camera. And my belly about to pop. I bet that giraffe would like to have a little boxing glove in this. One of them veterinarians coming out and go, pop them right in the mouth. But anyway, today's video, thank you, my friend John. Long time friend, will always consider him a friend. And has a YouTube channel, don't forget to view his channel. Movie John 75, MJ 75. You go over and view his channel, subscribe, like. I know I ain't got many subscribers, many viewers, but the ones that do got, go check him out. He had a very cool thing the other day with the little helmets man from the XFL. Everybody remember that? Man, that's some pretty neat little helmets, man. He had a nice little collection. Gave some insight on some of the games and stuff. So go check that out, man. He's got some other stuff, too. And even go back and look. He's been doing this like seven years. Go back and look some of his older videos, his random videos. He got, <laughs> he got something funny. He got one where he just opens the fridge, I ain't gonna lie, and get a thing of milk. And he just pours it all over his head. That's funny, man. Go check him out. But anyway, thank you for sending me this video. If you didn't see my video the other day, well, I was kind of criticizing the Bears a little bit. Cutler, you ain't done nothing. The Bears don't have a good coach. The Bears ain't got good nothing. <clears throat> Cutler, you didn't do nothing in Chicago. You were one of the most overrated quarterbacks in history. Bye-bye. And I hope you don't land on a team. If you've already landed on a team, shame on that team. But the Bears, oh, yeah, we're going to turn this corner. we going to sign quarterback Mark Sanchez. Really, Bears? Really, front office, is he going to bring us around? You might as well go ahead and sign back up Tim Tebow, baby. Yeah, we're going straight to the Super Bowl, ain't we? What a laugh. What a laugh. Anyway, here's when the Bears were good. Let me tell you something. Offense. You got Jim McMahon, baby. Jim McMahon, baby. <laughs> You understand me? There he is right there. You see that? Right here. Walter Payton. Slap him, Payton. Slap him on the butt. Tell him good game. That guy actually tackled you. Look, he had a breath and everything. Got his hands on his hip. And he ain't doing the dip. Get off here. We're going to see the Bears. The Bears went on to win this game. And I'm going to watch some more of this video. Like 46 to 10. There you go, Peyton. There you go, Peyton. Get him, baby. Get him, baby. To me, Walter Peyton was one of the greatest of all times. As far as running backs, I think he is a top five in NFL history. To me, a top five. Sweetness. Now, let me tell you something. Offense of the Bears, 85 Bears were good. But the defense, to me, was even better. 
I mean, Richard Dent, Rivera. Man, sometimes they put the fridge in there. And he looked like a fridge. Fridge, are you still alive? Is the fridge still alive? Sometimes you don't know what you believe on the internet. See people pass away like the newt bowl and stuff like that. But man, then they had one of the best in the middle. Pop you every time had the eyes on defense. And I ain't talking about Erlacher. He was good too. But I'm talking about back in 85, baby. Mike Singletary. He would just hunt you down. Boom! Tough acting to nothing, baby. And then, I had almost forgot about him until I watched his video John sent me. The kicker. Man, just hugs to him. Kevin Butler, baby. Kevin Butler. Got the one bar going across his face, man. Back in the day, well, football was football. Nowadays, it's a little bit glamorized. They didn't glamorize there. They just, you know, Gentry running in the backfield. Willie Galt. I mean, come on now. They even had a rookie running back they put in at the end of the game. <coughs> I've already watched bits and pieces of all of this tape. Sanders. That may not be in the Barry Sanders, but it was a Sanders. Get him, Julius Adams. Come on. You can do it. You can do it from New England. There you go. You got on the tackle of a bear, didn't you? Good job. You got one tackle in the game. Thank you, Lord. But I don't know if the Bears were just that good or if New England was just that bad. Like I said, 46 to 10 outcome in this Super Bowl. 85 Bears. Got to go down as one of the top 10 best teams ever. Top 10. I think you got to put them out. Tell me what you think. Leave me some comments. <clears throat> Tell me what you think. You think the Bears 85 team is one of the top 10 teams ever? And also leave me a comment. Do you think the 85 Bears could beat last year's New England Patriots? If it's if the Bears were playing last year's New England Patriots, could they still beat them? I, myself, I think the 85 Bears could have beat last year's New England Patriots. <clears throat> I, I, I really do. I really do. But like always, you get God in your life. If you got him there, keep him there, son. Boo! I'm back, baby. I'm back, baby, just for a minute. Just a little more of the video here. Just... 85 Bears. Just reminiscing here and when they were good. There we go, baby. Oh, who's coming into the game? Oh, it looked like at the one-yard line. Refrigerator's in there. He didn't run the ball, but they put fridge in. Did you see that? Refrigerator Perry. We just talking about him, baby. McMahon runs the touchdown. Yeah. New England thought the big boy, the refrigerator, was going to get the ball. All right. Y'all have a blessed day, baby. 85 Bears. Peace.